Donald Trump walked outside of Trump Tower yesterday and was absolutely mauled by the people who want to support him. I have seen it firsthand across this country in every state in the country. And you know what I saw yesterday and I continue to see today? Weak elected leaders who want to put their own political interests first. Reince Priebus is a great example. Donna Brazil, tough as nails, would hold the Democratic Party together and held the Democratic Party together under the Clinton leadership and the, all the scandal that happened there. The Democrats all stuck together. You know what happens to the Republicans? We need an apology. Donald Trump makes an apology and say, we're leaving anyways. It's egregious. There, there is absolutely no... So you say Reince is weak. Yeah, absolutely. Not only is he weak, he's a failed leader. And on top of that, let me just tell you something. The American people are so tired of the people in Washington, D.C. telling them what okay. to do. That's why they've stood That's why Donald Trump beat all of the establishment, all of the people who were supposed me... to be the leaders of the party moving forward. Donald Trump beat them all. He got 14 million votes in the primary, and he's going to okay. win the Let me election. ask you. Donald Trump has tapped into something that the Republicans have lost for the last 30 years, which is the rank-and-file people out there. That's why they're upset. That's why they so, took Donald Bakari. Trump as their nominee. And that's why Donald Trump continues to have 75% of the Republicans self-identified supporting Donald Trump and all the Republican leadership who want to self-preserve okay. themselves, make sure that they're elected in the next cycle, are walking so away.